What's going on chess fanatics? We made it to day 30. We'll take a look at to recap. I'll probably put out a video later on uh, this month at some point, kind of looking at just the trending and progress that we've made throughout the last 30 days, uh, some of the openings that we've played, um, and really what we plan to do in the future. Really haven't studied too much throughout this process, although I am looking to put in a little bit more time uh, throughout the next 30 days and see if there's any variance in performance. Hopefully people will find that interesting. In other news, we are here, of course, to play the final game in the 10 minute rapid rapid series, at least final game for this 30 day period. And on that note, we're going to just jump into the pool and see who we get. Switch over the uh, board here. OK, our first 1700 King of Kong 22 and they open with E4 opponent out of Canada. Okay, we're gonna go bishop b4. Now, I, ideally, we probably should have, you know, looked to park our knight out here. We're gonna go with a little bit of a unusual maneuver. Uh, they may chase us down. That's okay. What we want to do. Just line this up. And if we see takes, takes, I would be happy with that position. Uh, you know what? We'll just do it ourselves. Takes. Uh, okay. Wait a second. It seems like, uh, you know what? Let's just do this. Hmm. Okay. What do we do? Let's see here. I got a little bit of time. It's probably a good time to take a minute and think what makes the most sense. What if we just simply kick the knight out? What is the move? Are they going to just go crazy and play g4? Okay, so they do go and play g4. That's okay. Now, what if we... Okay, you know what? They're going for that rook, but this comes with check, so we'll just do that. Um, okay. We'll protect with the bishop. Now, play check. I'm assuming just bring the bishop back. And what we will do is target this pawn. Oh my gosh. What were we thinking? Huge, huge blunder. Absolutely, absolutely brutal. Kind of comical, though. Kind of comical. I mean, you hate to see it, but talk about an unforced error. Okay. I think what we'll try and do is see what kind of pawn play we can get. We do have a bit of a majority here with a passer on the C file. Okay. Now. I don't know if castling here is a good idea or not, but that's what's happening. We're going to drop this pawn, but think all things considered we are okay with that okay we're gonna have to give ourselves a little bit of space here 
Now hopefully we'll be able to just run this pawn. Obviously not going to be quite so easy, but opponent is attacking this week. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, this is a tough one to get out of. Boy, we really, uh, really blew it. I gotta say. So what if we just move the king? We're gonna see takes. Yeah, I mean, there's just not a lot to be done. Bit of a sad move. Bit of a sad move. Uh-oh. Okay. I'm assuming just h4 here. Yep. Okay. Rook over. Yeah, and there we go. That's mate. Guys, I uh, gotta say, not the greatest way to end uh, after that brutal rook blunder. I mean, just uh, just a terrible maneuver. We were clearly winning, and then all of a sudden, just threw it away. Um, got a good opening. I was really happy with the position that we got here. Uh, they basically just hung that bishop. Uh, all of a sudden, you know, tried to get, I don't know what I was even thinking here, cute somehow with this, and instead of just returning back, I wind up, you know, hanging a rook. Just absolutely brutal. Of course, we should have just come back and kept our monstrous lead. You know, focus in these games is uh, always a bit of a challenge. Uh, this, this really goes to show it. I don't know how you guys... Uh, seem to fare, but sometimes these games, man, they just, uh, uh, I don't know, have you lose uh, lose a little bit of focus. So uh, let's just finish off the analysis here and see what we missed. I mean, it was pretty bad position here on out. I felt like there's not uh, not really a lot to, to play for at this point in time. Uh, you know, real shame. I cannot believe that we just let that one slip away, but that's how she goes sometimes. Uh, looks like we're rated 1645 at the end of the 30th day. Uh, stay tuned for more on how the first 30 days went. All right, talk to you later. Bye.